Hey YouTubers, Wally here. Hey, sorry it's been a while. Well, spring is back, so you got to get back in my garden. But this, you know, here's the sweet potatoes going. They're doing pretty good. And then we got the purple lily koi. It's going nuts over here. No flowers yet, but hopefully by May or so, I'll start having some flowers showing up. Now I got my pikaki in the ground. Pineapple still growing. Some more pineapples here. I see one is starting to grow in there. And then all the citrus trees are doing good. The Hawaiian orange. And my fig tree I had to trim it back a little bit. It was getting too tall. And the tangerine trees. See all the flowers forming already. Getting ready. Got a lot of new, new growth coming on too. Like all over. Let's me know spring is here. And the mountain apple tree is doing good. And then this is the honey tangerine, the improved Myers lemon, and the rangpur. I want you to take a look over here. I got this the mango tree that I grafted. But you notice got little itty bitty mangoes. <laughs> I'm just gonna leave them on for a little while to see what see what happens. But this one's still doing good. Then got this red zinger still going and then we got these pineapples. These are already blooming and looking pretty good. I cleared out the other ones, if you notice, I put grapes in now. So I got a Cabernet Sauvignon in this one. I'm gonna do it in a goblet style, kinda like I guess you say like a tree. I'll prune it back to about maybe three canes and then leave about two buds and let them grow from there. I'll see what kind of support I'll need later. This is the red flame from last year that was in the pot. I went ahead and put it in the ground. Now it's doing good. It's actually growing up. This is the one I'm forming the trunk on now. Then I pruned down the Thompson. See this? Sorry about the sun. And then I have a Chardonnay on this side and we'll do it the same way so this year i'm just going to let it let the cane grow and then i'll cut it back next season to start forming the trunk and then the big old pineapples growing still in the pot here hasn't started no blooming yet or the flower not coming out yet grapefruit tree and this is the Hawaiian orange with the Mineola tangelo grafted on this side. So I got two fruits going to be coming up on this tree. We got a lot of, a lot of new growth though. See all the flushing going on. I do some yard work. <coughs> this is the Kalamandan. A lot of flowers, a lot of new, new growth. Being pushed out. Nice. And this is the Mineola tangelo. A lot, of, a lot of new growth over here. Just pushing out and you can see all the, the little flushes going on all over this plant. This one's going really good. And then this is the Suriname. I have to actually prune it. <laughs> it's going nuts and then the papaya tree. The papaya tree that we cut down is actually growing back. So I'm going to cut it down to like one branch. And then this is the red flame that I have against the I have an early shoot over there, so we're going to see what happens. Yep. And then way over there I got my big old, big old fat grapefruits. Can't even think of the name right now. Slipped my mind. We call it Jabong, but I know there's an English word for it. But yeah, that's basically what's going on for the springtime. I'll keep you guys updated on as the spring goes along. And that's what's going on. Love the pineapples, they look real cool. Took them a whole year to get to this, this stage right here. But okay, y'all take care. Have a good one now. Bye-bye.